The Six, Raptors, Diamond. With the release of Views, Drake is once again putting Toronto, which he affectionately calls The Six, in the spotlight. But when it comes to Drake's ambitions, The Six is just the start. There's the clothing line, coats for Canada Goose, the restaurant he opened with celebrity chef Susser Lee, plus what every rapper needs, his own brand of whiskey. Smart moves according to this former music manager. Being at the top of music is hard. Staying at the top of music is really hard. So if you can build equity in other things that feel natural to you and your audience, it makes sense. Part of his ability to build that audience comes from Drake's savvy marketing and a willingness to laugh at himself. I don't take myself too serious, so like I, I expected the reaction. I mean, I was praying for it. Drake is going viral once again, sharing a web page that lets you take the Drake image from his new album cover and plunk him, well, just about anywhere. Where Drake does get serious is talking about money. I got car money, fresh start money, I want Saudi money, I want art money. With deals with Apple, Sprite, Nike, Drake ranks third on Forbes' latest list of hip-hop cash kings. He says making the list is pretty much my objective every year other than making good music. But does the music suffer? This hip-hop writer has been following Drake's rise from the start. There are things to criticize. Like, lyrically, he's actually not as specifically sharp as he was maybe three albums ago. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, he hasn't lost the magic. And while Drake describes the new album as an ode to Toronto... The question I wonder now is, like, how much will Drake's phenomenal, unprecedented success benefit the entire hip-hop community of Canada? For the moment, Drake is building brand Drake focused on becoming Canada's biggest musician turned mogul. Story stay the same through the money and the fame. Eli Glasner, CBC News, Toronto.